Young and the Restless, The Rise and Fall of Power is a theme that never gets old. Nate Hastings, with his intelligence and ambition, has found a place in the heart of Victor Newman, who has a vision and always knows how to maintain his empire. The unexpected partnership between Nate and Mamie is raising questions about an as-of-yet-unrevealed plot, a plan that could shake the foundation of the Newman family. Nate, despite being trusted by Victor and entrusted with important tasks, does not feel satisfied with what he holds. This dissatisfaction not only comes from the desire for power, but also stems from a soul that always wants to prove and overcome all limits. For Nate, the position of CEO of Newman Enterprises is not only a step forward in his career, but also a symbol of ultimate success. Victor, with his strategist instincts, noticed a change in Nate's attitude and goals. No one knows more about maintaining power and dealing with those who threaten it than Victor. He knows that in the game of power, there's nothing more dangerous than a person who holds trust but harbors his own plot. Therefore, Victor began to closely monitor Nate, ready to detect and block any move that could threaten his throne. Mamie, although she's appeared less in recent episodes, any return of her cannot be underestimated. She has deep ties to the Abbott family and a strong understanding of the past, which can help Nate better understand the connections between powerful families and Genoa City. Any plan she advocates can take advantage of these secrets and insights. We can expect an intense confrontation between Nate and Victor, with Nate using every skill and connection to get closer to his goal. Meanwhile, Victor will constantly analyze and prepare for possible scenarios, always ready to protect his kingdom from any rebellion. And at the heart of all these events is the big question, how will Nate carry out this plan? Will Mamie's help be enough for him to overthrow the man who built one of the world's most powerful businesses? Or will Victor, with his experience and wisdom, prove once again that he's unbeatable? The situation forced her to make big moves, even appropriating a valuable asset, like Jabot or Newman Enterprises. This indicates that Mamie's not only looking to solve her financial difficulties, but may also be fighting off a threat of some kind, or this is a move for her to reestablish her position in the game, power play in the city. The alliance with Tucker and Nate is a notable development, but as Tucker is also a very ambitious character, and once had big plans involving major companies in Genoa City. Tucker's intelligence, ingenuity, and business experience may be the key to helping Mamie achieve her goals. And to Nate, given his current position within Newman Enterprises, and his desire to achieve more than he already has could be to be the one to execute these plans from within. Each character has their own motivations and goals, but the common goal seems to be to upset the existing power structure. Mamie, with her communication skills and human resource savvy, could make a developed detailed plan so that each side could benefit from the collapse or weakness of one of the two major families. This is important not to underestimate Mamie's ability and flair in moving her pieces. Her return, combined with Tucker's resources and power, and Nate's passion and desire to advance, creates an alliance that has the potential to change the power landscape of Genoa City forever. 